frontline terms, kind of military term that's being used and thrown around. I kind of viewed it as a sporting analogy. So we have a front line, middle line and back line. And capital projects tend to be the back line, the starting point where construction begins, where we engage with the doctors and the nurses to see what they require and what they need from us. Previously, we had multiple projects on the go. Some of them had to come to a pause so we can assist with the COVID-19 areas. I was involved with the staff amenities and they were change room facilities that we tried to provide for the frontline workers, the doctors and the nurses. It was quite a challenge because space is quite difficult amongst the hospital, so we had to find spaces that weren't currently occupied and how we could draw plans and work out new layouts. The main challenge was the balance between personal life and work life. We did do a lot more hours, late hours, not only to manage our workload, but to manage the daily routine of the hospital. Isolation, shutdowns, mitigations. When something like a pandemic arises, then kind of get thrown in the deep end and you need to work with it, make decisions on the fly and just have to get it done. I'm pretty proud of the way we've all come together as an organisation, as a team, within capital projects, engineering, frontline workers, and what role as individuals we can play, whether large or small, everyone has to come together in order to do their bit to beat this. It's rewarding when you see the wards start taking place, you see the amenities go live, and when you see some smiles on staff's faces, that's what's really rewarding during such difficult times.